A big break in a cold case. The Brazos County Sheriff's Office has named a likely suspect in the brutal 1981 killing of local real estate agent Virginia Freeman. They point to a convicted murderer who was put to death back in 1999. News 3's Whitney Miller has been following the case and joins us now live from the Sheriff's Office. Whitney. Well, you guys, the sheriff's office has been trying to figure out who killed Virginia Freeman for nearly four decades. Freeman was a well-known realtor who was murdered on the job. Her death sent shockwaves to her fellow colleagues and changed the way realtors do business in the community. With new DNA technology, investigators were able to determine the likely suspect is James Otto Earhart. He was a Brazos County resident at the time of the murder. Last year, investigators were able to use DNA found under Freeman's fingernails to do a genealogical search that led them to Earhart through his son's DNA. Earhart is a convicted murderer. He was ex executed in 1999 for the murder of nine-year-old Candy Kirkland of Bryan. It is also an incredible example of the tenacity and the perseverance of the investigators in this case. Our investigators traveled the state, other states, had cooperation with numerous other investigators and detectives and labs uh, in doing so. But it was that perseverance that has led us to this point. Now, in, in a statement to News 3, the children of Virginia Freeman had this to say, we are grateful to Sheriff Chris Kirk, criminal investigator Kenny Elliott, the Brazos County Sheriff's Office, and all others involved in solving the case of our mother's murder. We hope that this brings some closure to all who were affected by this crime. Now, Sheriff Kirk says he is 99% sure that Earhart is the guy, uh, but they will be exhuming his body to match his DNA to get a 100% match. Coming up at 10, we'll learn just how they were able to solve this mystery. In Bryant, Whitney Miller, News 3. Okay, Whitney, thank you for that report.